Exploring Science and the Sea Polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, PAHs, are common compounds. They form the tasty bark on a slice of brisket, for example. But they can cause cancer, so it's best to avoid them. PAHs are also bad for young fiddler crabs. And in combination with sunlight, they're even deadlier. PAHs are among the compounds found in crude oil. When oil spills into the ocean, some of it settles to the bottom. Many of the compounds in the oil can remain in the sediments for decades. None of those compounds is good for marine life, but PAHs are especially bad. A recent study found that young fiddler crabs are among the organisms at risk from them. Researchers placed adult crabs that were ready to reproduce in large tanks. Sediments at the bottom of the tanks contained PAHs at levels that might be seen years after an oil spill. Female crabs carry their eggs outside their bodies. So, as the crabs burrow, their eggs are exposed to any chemicals mixed with the sediments, including PAHs. When the eggs hatch, the larvae head for the surface, where they're exposed to sunlight. The ultraviolet rays in the sunlight can react with the PAHs, killing crabs with levels of the compounds that normally wouldn't hurt them. Adult crabs didn't seem to be harmed by the combination of low-level PAHs and sunlight, and neither were larvae that weren't exposed to the light. But most of the larvae that did see strong daylight died, victims of a toxic combination. For the University of Texas Marine Science Institute, I'm Holly Brawley.